Development along the Clyde from Glasgow Green to Erskine, a journey of some eight miles, began more than 500 years ago. Throughout those centuries, the River Clyde has nourished the city and played a vital role in its growth. Now, in the 21st century, the river is being reborn. The silent decades of post-industrial decline are giving way to a new vision, which once again will fill these riverbanks with hope and energy. This new waterfront will bring growth and prosperity to Greater Glasgow and to Scotland. The Clyde Waterfront Partners are committed to building a world-class waterfront, a magnet attraction for business and leisure with people and communities at its heart. The river's energy, harnessed to public and private sector commitment, will result in the delivery of a 15-year plan, creating 33,000 jobs and improving the quality of life for all the communities, from Glasgow Green to Erskine. Symbols of the new aspiration are in place. The Clyde Auditorium, affectionately known as the Armadillo, and the Glasgow Science Centre are a tangible reflection of a new confidence. The Glasgow Harbour development and plans for the new BBC headquarters take this confidence even further. Seldom in the city's history are there opportunities for such change. The Clyde has flowed silently in Glasgow's post-industrial landscape, but now there's a new current of optimism in its ancient waters. It's the imagination and vision 